shaped like a man's cock. Hello, Chucks. On Blind Date tonight, we're gonna have a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of... And over to you, Esther. Thank you, Cyril. We found the electricity board, and then... A child's teddy bear, which when squeezed, exploded, showering broken glass and the razor blades. A lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of... Not a lot. Say yes, uh, here we go, Dr. Professor, Mr. Sergeant... A oh, bored shitless me. There's never out on telly small. these days. Let's watch Chippendale's video again. It's better than all this crap. Oh, yeah, go on. I love him with Big Packet. We can stop it again at that bit where he says bollocks. Oh, aye, I could freak myself daft to that. Unless, of course, you know better. Cyril. Esther. Gavin. Thank you, Esther. Lots of very, very beautiful ones, green ones, and of course, lots of beautiful Hey, look, it's that bird with fat arse. She wants to do something about her shape, she does. Aye, bloody and fat so cow. Fat Turn it up, I want to see what she's on about. We'll be back on that next week. And this week on the holiday show with me, Annika Rice Crispy, we'll be sampling the delights of caravan holidays on the Cornish coast. It's cheap, cheerful, and you're guaranteed a good time, if not good weather. <laughs> Anyway, last summer I was paid a lot of... This sounds all right, doesn't it? Oh, yeah, Cornwall's great. All the fishermen and that. They're a bit random, them lot. Hey, shut up. You get us all excited. Oh, blokes in Cornwall, they're always willing to give a girl a cream tea. Oh, yeah. All them big, muscly fishermen will always split a kipper with you. Oh, yeah. And I'll bet they give you one up the arse and all. What? And they'll come in your gob. Cornwall, here we come. This is the uh, Embassy Regal Rothmans Roadmaster Deluxe Mark II. It really is a beautiful caravan. Uh, sleeps eight in comfort. The kitchen's equipped with a microwave, dishwasher, fridge freezer and deep freeze. The living room's got a colour TV, video, pool table, open fire, there's a jacuzzi. <laughs> All right, steady on, girls. A shower cubicle, sauna, sunk a marble bath. Oh. There's a full-size snooker table in the billiard room. Imagine. Uh, water beds, oh. full weight and servitory. It really has got the lot. It's a beautiful piece of work. It really is a home from home. In fact, the Queen's got one of these. Oh, bugger me blind. That's perfect, that is, isn't it, Trey? How much is it for weekend? <laughs> Have a lovely weekend, girl. See you on Monday.
Fucking hell, Sam, we've been past here before. Where the bloody hell are we? Oh, bugger it. This map you've given me is upside down. You bloody got us lost, haven't you, you daft cow? It's not my fault. It's this map. It must be wrong way around or something. I tell you what, Trey, if I don't get something to eat soon, I'm gonna faint. Oh, yeah, me and all. It must be ten minutes since we stopped at that cafe. I am bloody starving. Yeah, these blokes will know the way. We can ask them for directions. <laughs> hey, look, they've got Sarnies. Hey, mister. Me and my mate got lost. We haven't had out to eat for days. <laughs> yeah, we're fucking starving us. Oh, you couldn't spare us a couple of them sarnies, could you? With that week, we can hardly stand. Aye, and have you got any biscuits and all? But Jesus, would you look at these two? You can certainly have a few sandwiches, girls, but how are you going to pay for them? Oh, eh. Yeah. Shall we can come to some amicable arrangements? Uh, well... Oi, leave some for me, you greedy bitch. Hey, Trey, what are them bits? The red bits. The roads, there, ma. Red ones are big and the yellow ones are little. Then what are the blue bits? Well, they'll be the one where street sauce. I don't know. Where are we anyway? Um, if that's the river and uh, if them's the trees, then uh, we're on a road, then... Uh... Oh, I haven't got a fucking clue. Hey, Trey, I'm starving again. Never mind that. Look here, I think us luck's changing. You? Oi! Hello, darling. Oh, put your thumb in here. Oh, thanks for stopping, girls. I thought I was going to be stood there all day. So, um, how far are you going, then? Oh, don't worry, son. We go all the way. <laughs> Do you fancy me? My mate fancies you. Fuck off! I do not! She does. And she says she wants to go out with you. You fucking liar! I do not! I think he fancies you, Trey. He's giving you the eye. Do you fancy me? I'll give you a kiss if you like. Uh, uh actually, I think I'll just get out here. Don't be daft. Come here, love. I'll make you feel better. Ah, come on, ah, give us a kiss. Ah, come on, little boy. Let's get in your toe. We're doing it for now. Don't need yourself. Get your car. Let me out. Ah, get off me. No, no. Oh, God. No, no, no. Let me get it on in. I tell you Get off me. No, please. I'm only 12. Stop it. No, stop. Get off. Leave it alone. Now, pack it up. Oof. Ah, here's your handbag, you frigging bum boy. Ah, we're not giving lifts to bloody queers. Bloody queer, he couldn't even get it up. Yeah, shirt lifter. Must have been driving for hours and there's not been one McDonald's, that's there. Here, I could murder a burger with chips. Yeah, never mind that. I'm busting for Lou. If we don't stop, I'm gonna piss myself. Look, we can stop here, eh? Oh, this looks all right. <laughs> hey, 
This is fucking gorgeous, this. Yeah, we'll stop here. You know, I needed that. I'm going to have a look to see if I can find something to eat. Who are they, Par? They be townies, Jethro. Is they ladies, Par? That's right, son. They be ladies. Can I touch them? Maybe, son. Maybe. Yeah, it's lovely air, isn't it? That strange fucking lush. I bet there's fish in it and everything. I reckon it's dead boring. There's no shops or anything. It's a good job I brought a flask of chips and bloody starving. Get off my land! <gasps> you can't stop here. Why not? This is my field and you've been worrying my sheep, so you has. That's right, Pa. They was worrying them. Oh, fucking hell, keep your hat on. We're only having a picnic. Up now, you might know a place where you can park that there caravan. Nice place it'd be, overlooking the sea and all. Oh, that sounds nice, doesn't it, Trey? A sea view, eh? There's bound to be a chippy. Is it far, then, or what? I'll show you where it be. But first, you'll have to be nice to my boy, Jethro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hmm, big, strong lad like him. I think that could be arranged. Hurry up, Trey. Leave some it for me. Remember how the pigs do it, Jethro. Wee! For miles, Trey. He said it wasn't far. We're nearly there. Oh, this must be it. He said it was first right, third left, up the hill, then right and right again, didn't it? Aye, something like that. Well, this must be it then. Come on, we'll stop here. What's on telly, Trey? They've got a telly. I'm bored and hungry. I'm feeling ranza. I'm gonna dream about George Michael tonight. It's fucking daft having a seaside without a chippy. It's gonna attack us from behind, right? Hey, I brought my Chippendales video. We haven't got a video either. Fuck. I can murder a bag of chips. Yeah, me you know. Get in the car. Get in the car and drive away. <sighs> this is the life. Lots of fresh air in that. I lost fucking pounds already. Come on, Sam, let's do some exercises. Hey, hang on, mate. Oh. Finish me breakfast yet. Well, come on, then. We'll be all skinny like Carly Minogue on Monday morning. <laughs> <laughs> Could easily spar a lot of love. Oh, God, shit, listeners. There's nothing out on Jelly these days. With Tippy Dale's videos, fuck me. It are in the caravan. Hey, Jackie, give me quite a scratch, man. It's itching like fucking buggery. Oh, fuck. Oh, buggery. 